Thank you, Master of Ceremonies and Distinguished Guests. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. On a cold winter day in a classroom, I asked my eighth grade student, Hey, I have a math quiz for you. Are you ready? Yeah. So, minus three plus five equal to what? Then, she can't the answer? Eight. Eight? Eight, do you know the meaning of minus? Mm, not really. Okay, I'll explain. This conversation may sound a little funny, but actually, it is no laughing matter. This 14 year old girl fell behind in her classes and even couldn't answer such an easy question that she could only expect up here. This is exactly what I experienced while I was teaching some children living in a local community as a frontier. Today, the topic I would like to talk about is the poor children with low academic abilities in Japan. And in order to help them, I will introduce activities that everyone can put to them, which is that more and more children can grow in their future with hope. Now, most of you believe that Japan is a very wealthy and well-educated country. However, in reality, over 2 million children in Japan are living below the poverty. They live in a household that earns less than half Japan's average income, so children cannot get what everyone usually takes for granted. For example, they have no debt to study at home. They cannot afford to go to the grammar school with the mind of text. In such an environment, developing children's study habits is nearly impossible. Sadly, conscious research is that children who are in the poverty are much more likely to be left uh, behind and study. This situation produces a vicious cycle of poverty. In Japan, where the academic career is highly valued, that children with low academic abilities are more likely to end up getting broken jobs than lead their lives. Moreover, this short of money leads to the lack of education again in the next generation. Thus, poor children cannot escape the cycle of poverty. However, poverty is not destiny. This cycle can come to an end with education. So, what is needed is an environment where all children can get the help in education and learn what they cannot understand. In classes. Hence today, I would like to introduce the free Khan School. At this school, professional teachers or volunteers teach students for free after the daily classes. And teachers usually teach students in a class of three students or fewer, so students can easily ask questions to teachers and solve them. In fact, Teach for Japan is one of the most successful cases. It has already helped over 2,200 students in only four years. However, in spite, in spite of these efforts, millions of poor children still, still fail in their classes. Actually, these activities are not well known in Japan, so more volunteers are needed in order to support more students. So, if you will, I would like you to share knowledge with these poor children. If you have something to give, even now. You can participate in activities of non profit organizations such as People Japan and so on, and you can easily apply to people and teachers through the internet. Through the volunteer, I have many opportunities to support their fortune. I still remember one of my students vividly. At first, she didn't try to study all of them. Sitting in front of the test, that with peers. I can't answer the question. I can't. However, once I helped her, gradually she began to understand her problems. The more questions she solved, the harder she tried to study. And with her efforts, 
Eventually, she could improve her score drastically by the final test. And at the last class, she came up to me, and then, in a cheerful voice, with a happy smile, she said, Thank you, Mr. Higashi. I really enjoyed your classes. With your help, I can do it. And I promise I'll keep on studying hard. I promise. I was speechless. Tears just welled up in my eyes. Looking at her face, I couldn't stop believing the change is possible. With a little help, that children can study her to learn more and change themselves. And ideally, that do something for these fortunate and for their shining spots. Millions of poor children are left uh, behind in stuff. It's happening here. It's happening now. It's preventing too many children from leading the life cycle. However, through interacting with them, I strongly believe that they can change the story of their lifetime by education. So why don't we be their chances, their chances to be educated and open up their future? And if not us, then who? And if not now, then what? No child should be left behind. And I heartily hope that's more and more people will try to support these children now, to give them the great hope for their life.